The goal of my work is to understand the neurobiology of addiction. Like everything else in life, knowledge is power, and even more so here for treating disease. So you have to understand some of the fundamental biology in order to develop new treatments. And so by understanding what is off in the human brain, we'll be able to develop new technology and new pharmacological interventions your DNA gives instructions for genes being turned on and off to induce a specific behavior. And one of our more recent studies, we were able to identify specific epigenetic marks. These marks are on the DNA and they're really critical and give us some of the first clues as to some of the long-term impact of drugs on the brain. They are a really novel way to start thinking about new treatments for an addiction. How can science really help the individual patient and the population at large? My hope for people with addiction is to give them their life back. I want to give their families their lives back. The Addiction Institute at Mount Sinai can really drive novel ways of treating our patients. Patient first, science-based medicine, period.